youths in Singapore are getting a louder voice and a bigger hand in shaping policy. Starting this year, those aged 15 to 35 will get the chance to play a leading role in identifying policy issues they care about. They'll work hand in hand with government agencies and maybe even get their recommendations debated in Parliament. It's all part of new youth panels being introduced by the Culture, Community and Youth Ministry and the National Youth Council. We will share our policy considerations and trade-offs, exchange data points, and most importantly, think with them on these questions. And against this backdrop, we will create space for our young people to take the lead in the deliberations and formulate suggestions. The move stems from Forward SG Youth Engagements, which found significant and sustained interest in national issues. The plan is to set up two to three panels this year on topics that young people from diverse backgrounds will help identify. They will also examine trade-offs, conduct, re conduct research and engage with interested parties, and then develop recommendations. Cinder's Youth Club says this is a chance for young people to exercise their voice and help shape the country's future. So I would have you know, three rallying calls for the young people who are interested. I think one is patience, to understand that policy change is not easy. Second is perseverance, to rally not just uh, government stakeholders, but their fellow peers in this whole policy creation. And perspective, to understand how their views fit in the greater Singapore and even the global ecosystem.